okay so we have another problem here so the problem goes like this a, co a coin is tossed three times so what is the probability of getting three tails up so in this one we will be using the normal distribution probability or the normal uh, the, the, the probability of uh, su uh, succeeding events okay so the formula for that is just write here our solution formula for that is p is equal to ncr pr q n minus r in which our uh, ncr that is a combination our r is the number of successful trials then our n is the number of trials our p is the probability of getting three of getting the of getting the desired quantity so for this in this instance of getting three tails out of three trials so that is is a successful 100 percent and our q is getting uh as uh, the the small p is getting a single no, for a single throw of getting a uh, a certain uh, outcome so for this one getting a tail from a single trial and our q is not getting a tail from a single trial okay so we are going to find the big p here which is getting the three tails out of three trials okay so first we need to de determine our small p so this will be so on a single trial the probability of getting a tail so that will be one over two so the outcome is only two so tails or heads okay so the probability also of not gate getting a tail which is a head so that is also two so our number of trials is uh total number of trials to be given is three and the uh, uh, required or the desired number of successful trials is three okay so we need just to substitute the formula the given here this one to our formula so we have a uh, three combination three and we have our p is one half raised to the power of three then our q is one half raised to the power of three minus three so we have 3c3 1 half 3 times 1 half raised to the power of 0 so this will be automatically equal to 1 okay so this now will be equal to 1 so our p is equal to so let's have our calculator here so let's show also our calculator on the screen okay we should transfer our calculator over here okay so we have so three shift C okay so this one this is for the combination times uh, multiply by one half raised to the power of three so that will be multiplied by two one okay so equals so you have one over one over 27 so you have um you have uh one out of 27 chance of getting a consecutive tails in throwing uh three coins okay so that is the answer for this problem so this is the answer for this problem okay so let's just check first before we end this video so what uh, so one half so maybe okay so uh, so I was looking at my uh, solution a while ago 
there is something wrong with this one this is not one half a uh, one third but one half rather so the answer will be one eight so sorry for that so it's uh, it pays to check your solution before making it final as your final answer so this will be one eight so you have one out of eight chances of having three consecutive tails if you throw uh, three consecutive co uh, coins so three times you throw a coin okay so thank you for watching this video and i hope you learned something and as always have a good day